filling in the gap between Episode 6, Return of the Jedi, and 7, The Force Awakens. We are here discussing the interlude from Chuck Wendig's aftermath, Jakku. Jakku, a planet currently famous for being mysterious. A planet we know is where we find Rey in Episode 7, The Force Awakens. A planet we know was the site of a major and decisive battle between the New Republic and the Empire. But this interlude is before all that, when Jakku was just a planet, and not much else. Corwin Ballast has found himself on Jakku, looking for the local bar. He has just come here from his home planet of Mordal after having lost his daughter and wife, who were caught in the middle of a firefight between the Imperials and the Rebellion. He tells the bartender that he came to Jakku to get away from the war, and he believes this planet is about as far away from the war as possible, to which the bartender agrees. This exchange does come off as a bit humorous from the reader's perspective, as we know this planet will be very close to the war, very soon. While this interlude is rather light on story, we get our earliest chronological appearance of the planet and what it was like before the war came to it. We get to see a bit of its people and culture, or lack thereof. When one thinks of backwater planets, it used to be Tatooine as the prime example, but Jakku seems to be on a whole different level. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to keep up with all the insight and analysis found here at Star Wars The Canon Explained. You can also follow us on Twitter or visit us on Facebook. Till next time, may the Force be with you.